Hello mga kabalen! Kumusta po kayo? Today, we are going to make buko pandan. Very simple buko pandan. simple buku pandan for Christmas very very Christmassy here are my ingredients for my simple buko pandan and I'm using all in cans so I have this is optional I'm using the palm seed or atap and I am using the buko which is the coconut strings and I am using one can of nestle cream and one can of condensed milk so here are my ingredients and two packages of buku pandan gelatin. This palm seed is optional as my husband likes it so I'm just putting it. It's called palm seeds or hata. So I put 8 cups of water in a pot. The uh, instruction says uh, six, 6 cups per envelope but I'm only putting four, 4 cups of water per envelope because I want it firm. So this all in all is 8 cups. So I put the 2 envelopes of gelatin in the pan and uh, keep stirring it to dilute before turning on the stove so once it is diluted I will start the stove to simmer it until it is cooked I did not put sugar in the mixture because Everything that I'm putting in cans are already um, sweet, so we're not into sweet person. But if you like sweet, you can put uh, about two tablespoons of sugar in this mixture. So once it is already simmering, you can turn off the flame. And I'm going to pour it in a container and let it cool it there. Once you pour it in the pan and you see some bubbles, just remove the bubbles. And then uh, you can put it in the refrigerator to cool it down faster and make it firm faster. Now that the jelly is firm, you can cut it in cubes.
continue cutting it in June. Now you can start mixing your buko pandan with the other ingredients. So if you want your buko pandan more syrupy or more syrup, you do not throw the syrup in the palm seeds and the um, coconut, shredded coconut um, added together. But if you don't want more syrup, you can just uh, throw the liquid and just add the palm seeds and the shredded coconut without the, the syrup. So I combined the condensed milk and the nestle cream and then give it a mix. And you can now pour the coconut, shredded coconut, and the palm seeds. I'm going to pour also the liquid. Some people they do not um, include the liquid, but my hu my husband likes it more uh, liquid, so he can drink it. So I'm gonna pour. And then give it a mix. So give it a mix. And now you can put the gelatin. So after mixing, you can give it a stir and then you can put it in the refrigerator if you want it more syrupy or more liquid. But if you want it slushy when you eat it, you can put it in the freezer for about an hour or two. Mmm, this is so yummy. This is so good to serve it uh, on Christmas. If you want it to look more Christmassy, you can add some cherries, red cherries, um, the candied cherries. So it's red, white. I mean, it's red, white, and green. So here is the finished product. Very simple buku pandan. So here is my simple buko pandan. So if you want more um, buko or shredded coconut, you can put more. So um, it, it's up to you. If you want it sweeter, you can put more condensed milk. But for me, this is the right taste. So here is the finished product, Buko Pandan. Some people, they like it very thick. What you can do is mix it with a hand mixer until the condensed milk and nestle cream are thick. But my husband likes it more 
soupy or liquid so he can drink it while eating the buko pandan.